Hello everyone, my name is Amanda Pritchard and I'm the new Chief Executive of the NHS. I'm sorry I can't be with you today in person, uh, but I want to let you know how appreciative I am and the whole of the NHS is for the work that Healthwatch does. Your constructive, honest and friendly approach really does help make things better for patients. And I'd just like, if I may, to pay a particular tribute to Imelda Redmond. Her tireless work really has made a difference in putting patients at absolute heart of the NHS. And for that, really grateful and thank you, Imelda. Over the pandemic, the response of the NHS in partnership with so many others really has been extraordinary. We've had the NHS leading the way with the COVID vaccination programme. And even now we're achieving uh, new records uh, almost every day. Last week, a record number of people coming forward for their booster jabs. Uh, and we now have more locations providing vaccinations than we ever have before. So now almost every person registered with a GP will have a, uh, will have a fixed vaccination centre within 10 miles of their home. More urgent cancer checks have been carried out this summer than were happening before the pandemic. And we've also had a huge increase in the number of diagnostic checks uh, this year compared with last year. Primary care, once again, at the heart of our response and has delivered over 100 million appointments. And there are areas where, despite the disruption of the pandemic, the way people have had to work differently have meant that we're actually ahead of schedule in achieving some of our ambitions. For example, the rapid rollout of 27, uh, 24 seven all age mental health crisis lines means we've achieved that ambition three years ahead of target. And it's really important that we maintain this momentum on recovering services because we are going into a tough winter after the NHS's toughest summer. So it's just not going to be enough to just simply work harder. We are going to have to bring that same spirit of innovation that saw us transform care in response to the pandemic to find new ways to tackle new challenges. These are the sorts of things where we really have seen the benefit of new technologies, new ways of working that have helped the NHS accelerate the recovery of elective services and will help us as we go into this winter and beyond. We're working with our GPs and colleagues in primary care to help patients access their local surgery in the way that's right for them. And we are looking seriously at dental reform too. And I'm particularly grateful for Health Watch's con contribution to our work on this, of course, and so many other important issues. Health Watch is an important part of the team. And when a team faces a challenge, it faces it together. So this Health Watch week, I trust we can all come together to rise to the challenge, just as we have done over this extraordinary period of the pandemic. Uh, and we will hopefully, and I'm confident we will, do so again over this winter and beyond. So thank you and have a great conference.